a just a little unboxing video here. Got a package from Saracenia Northwest, CobraPlants.com. If you didn't know, they're a great website. Highly recommend them. Great plants. Yeah. Try to open this with one hand. It's kind of hard. Yeah, I'm going to have to lay this camera down. Just give me a second. Sorry if I'm making you dizzy. Just trying to open this box without cutting anything inside. There we go. See, I love on their side live plants, live plants, live plants. Oh, and their winterized shipping is amazing. I mean, you pay out the rear end for it, but it gets here like next day. What we got here? Oh, this is their, yeah, their invoice things. Oh, man, I got two heat packs in this one. It was extra cold. Yeah. They're uni heat. Good things. They give you their little... How to unpack, I already know that. They're different care guides from whatever you bought. There we go. Yeah, basically your regular packing peanuts, everything like that. I just got my tray set up here so that I can get these out. I mean, look at this stuff. Bubble wrapped like crazy. You can't get better packaging. I mean, it's nuts. Oh, some of these packing peanuts you get everywhere. My mom would kill me. Yeah, I got four things this time. That's what I usually order in is like fours. I don't know why it just ends up that way. I'm probably going to make an order again here soon. Probably get some cephalotus and some um um utricula or uticula, however you say it, bladder wart, terrestrial ones, long folia. Yeah. There we go. Yeah. That's all. You got your heat packs. Still rather warm too. They're like seventy two hours or something like that. Let's see what we got in this first one. Let's get some of these peanuts out of the way. Peanuts galore. Peanuts, peanuts, peanuts. <sighs> okay, um. Yeah, I'm going to have to unwrap these and then show you. So, I'm going to edit this part out. See ya. Okay, we're back. Man, those things are a pain to unwrap. Look at this. This is one thing's worth of bubble wrap. I mean, shipping is amazing. We got four plants, as you can see. This one's this one I think is my favorite. It's all wrapped up. Um, yeah, I don't know. We got. I I don't know if you can see this. It's kind of hard. But I'll show final pictures down in the greenhouse. Um, this is Drosera spatulata. The spoon leaf sundew. Drosera regia, the king sundew. That one's awesome looking. He's got super fat leaves, except for that, especially that one. That's awesome. Nepenthes. Um, cher Cherinana. I, I don't know how to say that one. If somebody can help me pronounce that. I'd appreciate it by Vici. They don't have any pictures, 
what's awesome about these is it has um the leaves and everything are actually hairy. I know you can't see it on the picture, but they're actually hairy leaves. They're pretty cool. Yeah, I'm gonna put this away before I hurt myself. I already stabbed myself once taking this thing, opening them up. And this one, you'll have to wait to see, because it's all kinds of wrapped up, is Pinguicula lauiana. It's pretty cool. It gets bright red flowers. For you people that don't know, Pinguicula normally have, like, violet flowers, purplish, except for this one. And, um, the, I think these two are the only ones that don't. This one has a bright red flower, and Pinguicula ceruleana has a blue flower. It's pretty cool. Yeah. So here, I'll try and show you on my invoice. I don't know how well this thing's gonna... Yeah, it's not gonna show you. Anyways, I'll open those up and show you down in the greenhouse, the final product. Okay, now we're in the greenhouse. I got them all unwrapped. I'll tell you, it's a job. I mean, look at this pile the, of just stuff that wrapped them in. I mean, you can't get better wrapping. Oh my gosh. I mean, it took me like 10, 15 minutes to unwrap these. Okay. I don't want to spoil any of the surprise. But, like because I'm going to make a total greenhouse carnivorous plant and regular plant overview probably here after this or when I get back whenever but let me move one of these out of the way so I don't spoil the surprise that's my favorite one right there okay here we go starting out with the Drosser Regia it's, it's pretty small it's just a baby one man the lighting here really stinks It's about uh, inch, two inch. I mean, look at this gigantic leaf, sword, sword leaf here that comes out of it. I mean, that thing's got to be, I don't know, like two centimeters wide. Um, yeah, let me move that one back over here I can leave it over there since you just saw that one this is my favorite one that was all wrapped up I mean it's it's colors have kind of dulled down since it was in the dark for a couple days getting shipped but it's Pinguicula Lawiana it's pretty cool it has the best shade of pink on it with a little green center and I need a better camera yeah, you can kind of see it. It's about as big as round as a um, quarter. I mean, you see my finger. Yeah. I got pretty big hands, too, so. And, let me move them back, because I have a big tray over here that I got my stuff in. Drosera Spatulata. I mean, this thing was like, six bucks but I mean there is like five or six different clusters on here I mean it, it's just like a half an inch tall with just Drosera spatulata and sphagnum moss I mean I was so happy with this I got that to cross with my pretty much specifically to cross with my Dross Recompenses. Get some other ones. I'm trying to get a collection going to have like one or two of everything. Whoops, gave you a little preview by accident. And my last one, on the other side of me. I don't want to give them away. Doo -doo 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 -doo. There we go. This is the Ching Chingalana by Vichii. 
and it is super, super hairy. It's awesome. It don't have any pictures on it, but it has tall, green, mottled pictures. It, it looks pretty cool. It's actually a natu naturally occurring hybrid. It comes from Borneo. The other ones I got of are just like raised in a greenhouse. Forced hybrids. They're pretty cool though. So yeah. That's all for my unboxing. I guess I'll see you guys later. There's a final view of them too. I can't show you the others. You just have to watch my other video. I'll see you. Bye.